Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Kingdom Come Deliverance. Today, we're going to go on a hunting trip with Sir Hans Coupon here. Uh, we got into a little fight with him in the last episode, and his superior, Sir Hanish, ordered us to guard him on a hunting trip just to try to bring us closer together, I think. So yeah, that's what we're going to do today. Before we do that, though, I'd like to go try to find some pants. Probably in the local area, just like in the castle or something. I don't want to run all the way back to Preshek's place. That's very hard. That's just hard. That's open. Can we even open hard locks yet? Oh, wow. We can. Let's see how bad this is. Whoa, it's actually not that hard. So I've noticed that there's like a variable in the difficulty of hard and very hard locks. Like some very hard locks you can unlock and then at the exact same level, at the exact same time, there'll be another hard lock or a very hard lock that you can't for whatever reason. I'm guessing it's just like quest Why stuff. Creeping around like a I was going to try to knock him out, but he's super perceptive and he knows we're here. And we probably can't go in there and he's relocked it. God damn it. That's annoying. I might sneak out and try to knock him out. I'm not sure how the reputation hit works. I know that if you kill him, people will uh, know about it, kind of. You won't get in trouble for it, but your reputation will go down, and they'll like you less and search you more and stuff like that. Nobody's in here, right? Like on any of these uh, things here? A camp, huh? Okay, can we sit there? No. And this is... Oh, wow. It's a toilet. Whoa! Whoa! Damn, you can actually sit on this thing too. Would you look at that? Have a nice little read, you know? And just really take care of business. Medieval times. I feel bad for anybody who's walking under there. Looks like there's actually a path. There is. Dear God. That's uh, mortifying. Okay, well let's crack this thing open. See if we can get us a pair of pants. I want to be properly situated for the hunting trip. We do have to hurry. We're on time a bit. We have to get back to uh, Coupon before uh, morning's over, I believe. Can you open these? Yeah, you can. Oh my god, that's worth a lot of money. Okay. <laughs> so, note to self, keep an eye out for cupboards. Especially when you're inside of a royal place like this. I wonder if I can loot the pitcher on top. Ah, you can't. Hmm. How about this? No? What's in here? Hello? There's a guard. Two guards. One's asleep. A hard chest. Hmm. I wonder if we can open that. Who is this? Oh my god, it's Captain Bernard. Huh. Well, let's get out of here. I think that might be where Hanish sleeps. If I remember correctly, he sleeps on this side of the, uh city could be wrong about that though no 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 yeah that's that's correct coupon sleeps on the other side like the side where we initially came to see sir radzik and then Ku or uh, hanish stays over here is he still there yeah he's still there man no luck on the pants let's go back into here and just see here let me close this it's getting quite late in the morning now what time is it okay i think we can probably Push it to about nine before we have to run over there. Pantless. Just with our PJs on. That'll suck. Anybody home? This looks like one of those things in Skyrim. You like step on it and it comes over and smashes you. Like in uh, the little Draugr crypts and stuff. Got another door. What's this? Oh my god, there's a guy standing there. Oh shit. I started running on accident. This looks like prime... Prime for a knockout. Let's try it. Oh my god, please, for the love of god. Oh, that's really bad. That's really, really bad. Lost your wind. No. Ow. No, I want my sword out. Hey. No. No! Yeah. What the f- You won't let me take my sword out. I'm dead. Well, guards are hard to knock out, I guess. I don't even know if we can knock one out, you know? It reset the morning for us. I guess we could try again just on this guy. We'll just act like, oh, I'm the cleaner. Yeah, I'm here to clean. 
Hey, bitch. Damn it. He closed it. Right before I could get in there. Well, we gotta replay this little part here where I open this chest, grab all that other shit. No biggie, though. I'm gonna knock that guy out. You trust me on that. I think it's because he knew we were there. Probably because I started running. Yeah, nothing new spawned in there. Um, cause like, I swear that you can knock guards out in scallops, in fact. Like, at the very beginning of the game. So it's probably just a perception thing and not so much a strength thing. Like, if they, if they perceive that you're there, then they're gonna turn around and, you know, do what they just did to us there. Uh, but if, as long as we sneak up on them, we should be golden. Uh, I gotta take off all this heavy stuff, including the van braces. Gotta remember those. Padded koi, hunter's gloves. We should be good now. Yeah, that's very quiet. Feel very nimble as well. I like being nimble. Hey. Shit. He busted us again. Okay, so I'm gonna go around the corner. I'm gonna walk. I'm not walking. Oh, God, I changed the key. I have a really squeaky shift key for some reason. And I haven't, like, pulled it out to see why. Probably gotta, like, lube it up or something. So I switched the, um, walk and run key around. That way I don't have to use shift. So we'll sneak up behind him. He keeps going in and out of this door here. I'm gonna wait a second. And then I'll go in. And I'll walk this time and see if we can get behind him and choke him out. Oh my god, why is this so hard now? There we go. Oh my god. The hell are you doing? <laughs> she must have seen us. She was saying something. Okay, so he's... I'll go up there after I choke this man out. And I definitely won't kill him. We may even take the reputation hit just for choking him out. But... I mean, we gotta do what we gotta do. We need some pants. And he's also probably got some really good armor and stuff on that we can use. And we might need it for the hunting trip, you know. And plus, who's gonna suspect Henry? We're the guard of Sir Hans Coupon. Man! He got us again! Okay, this time I'm picking up my fucking sword and I'm gonna whoop your ass. Trust me on that. I'm not going down twice. Not a chance. That's right. That's right. You messed with the wrong Henry today, sir. You may be fully kitted out, but I'm gonna beat your ass. Here, let me kick him. How do I kick again? Ow! It's F, I think. Uh, ow! Dude, I've been training with Captain Bernard. I'm bleeding bad! Oh, I'm gonna die again. Oh, god dang it, this sucks. Mm, we died in combat. <laughs> Alright, now it feels like we're cheesing the system a bit by just safe scumming, so I'm gonna quit trying to knock out guards. I will go grab that loot, and then if I can't find anything within a chest, I'm not gonna bother um, with the guard. I would loot something out of a chest, though, for sure. I may go upstairs and see what's up there. Maybe there's like a... A sleeping quarters or something that we can uh, loot, which might be useful. But no more guard choking out for us. Seems way too scummy. Uh, I want to open that again just for XP. Got to get it where we can, really. Now, we have to be mindful, because he does come out. We know his little rotation. Oh, God. I have a mind to call the guards. You are the guard, you big dumb boy. Okay, well that's not going to work. We're going to have to go somewhere else. I kind of just want to run back to Preshex. And grab pants. Maybe the tailor's opened. It might be early enough for the tailor to be opened. I'll go check real quick. Uh, and I want to take off this stuff so we run a little bit quicker. I don't know if you actually do, but it sure feels like it. So I'm going to do it just for the feeling of running faster. It's like when you get a go faster stripe on your convertible. You feel like really cool. You go really fast because of that go faster stripe. And if you're really awesome, you get two go faster stripes. Right down the middle. The townspeople are out. 
milling around. I can't wait till we see somebody here. I really hope it's uh, Qnesh <laughs> that we see. Wow, what time is it? What kind of establishment are you? No, it's six o'clock. I think it's normally like eight o'clock that places start to open up. A shop guard. Guards aren't even in uh, the shop yet, apparently. Here's the apothecary, or whatever they call it here. Well, I'm just gonna stand here for a bit, see if uh, these guys open up, I guess. We don't have too much time. Like I said before, can't be milling around for too long. And she's quite deft at it by now. I'm not surprised. Betty was always good with her hands. You're right there. Anyway, I showed a couple of pieces she made last time to old Thunder from Tabor. The one I buy goods from. Could you guys get to work? What are you here for? I'm here to buy stuff. Ah. Good luck then. I think that's her. Oh yay. We we interrupted it. Go. Go to your shop. I need to buy pants. Can't you see I'm running around with my PJs on? My delicates. I have to go on a hunting trip. I really don't want to have like really cut up legs. From like thistle and stuff. When I'm running around trying to hunt. You. Didn't anybody ever teach you some manners? Madam. I can see you. Jerk. Let me in. Alright now I'm getting mad. If I can't purchase stuff I'm going to steal it. Hmm. Too hard. How about down here? We were in there momentarily. We could go look in the bailiff's room. We're going to need sleep soon. Oh, it's hard. Oh, but we can get it. Cool. Let's go. Oh, shit. That's not good. There goes the lockpick. Yeah, that definitely feels harder. Hey. You're supposed to have big loot inside. Can't even interact with it. This is going to be very hard. Oh no, it's just hard. We're like a real thief now. Busting open like actual hard doors. Okay, he's going to be in here snoozing. Shit. I stood up right away like a complete dunce. Is someone there? Yeah, dude. What do you mean is someone here? It's Henry. <laughs> There's a guard. What are you doing? You guys have to be such a pain. Just need no pants, damn it. God knows what it was. Oh my god. There was literally a guy standing in the doorway. There's a tourney happening in Rite today. You can sign up with the Herald this morning. Pass on that for now. Hopefully that's a weekly occurrence. Because I want to get involved in a little tournament. We're probably going to have to open that door again. Yep. Well, let's be quiet so we can hear. Guard's gone. Hey, what are you doing here? Clear off quick, or I'll throw you out. God damn it! That's one of the shop guys. So they're definitely still asleep. I should have just ran to Preshik's house. For the love of God. What a mistake I've made. <laughs> I've wasted so much time. What time is it now? I'm really half tempted just to load the save again and then run to Preshik's. Should we punch him in the face and then do that? Oh, that's not even him. That you're old rich. Alright. Mistakes happen. I'm going back to the original save, and then I'll run to Press X, grab our pants, and then we'll go hunting. What a waste of time. I'm probably going to leave most of that in, though, just because it was, like, interesting to look around. Uh, I'll go grab those chalices and stuff, the uh, cups and whatnot, from upstairs, and unlock that easy chest to get the XP. And then from there, I will run to Press X house. God, we've played through this beginning part, like, three times now. <laughs> it happens. On the bright side, at least now we know that we can unlock hard locks. I thought we were going to be completely barred from doing that for quite a while. Oh, I looted those torches. I'm going to put them in our chest back at our house. Just in case if we ever need one. 
It was uh, three torches from the easy chest over there. All right, I'm going to open this door. I'm going to try this one more time. Despite not thinking that I can do it, I just want to see. Back trouble? Okay, no, he knows we're here. Oh, man, you're going to have back trouble when I karate chop you right in the spine. <laughs> It's the fastest way to pressure X house. It's down over here, I believe. Yep. Oh, wow. Look at that. It's really beautiful that you can just see the mill from here. Oh, we have a, a, a thingy. A treasure map. Rete? What? Where the hell is that? Hmm. Have I done this one? Oh, I think I might have, actually. I remember it being a real pain. It's probably like a weird garden. Uh, in the woods somewhere. It's gonna be hard to get it again because despite knowing that I had a hard time with it, I don't remember exactly why. Let's go easy on the old joints there, Henry. I would really like to get that perk where we don't have such a hard time with falling. Discovered a shrine. Can we read it? Edward Oliver Killigrew Penrose Esquire. Oh my god. That's a long name, sir. <laughs> I'm not even gonna try the other one. It was like Ahmed, brother, saint. Whole bunch of stuff. Try to get back to Coupon within like an hour. There's a path down this mountain. I know there is. I don't know why I do this to myself every time. Risking the leg break. It's the thrill of it, really. It's like the same reason you do the whole mountain jumping in Skyrim. It's just the thrill of it. You'll spend 30 minutes. You could have just walked around in that time. But you'll spend 30 minutes spamming that space bar. Just trying to glide up that mountain. Something really fun about it, to be honest. You feel like you've accomplished something. You get that nice little dopamine hit. Oh, man. For getting to the top of the mountain. You feel like you cheated the system. Uh, what? What? Oh, <laughs> I'd like turn to the right too soon, I think. Yeah, it must have. This is our house, right? Yeah, it is. We gotta take Teresa out on a little date or whatever. Do that courtship quest. All right, we're finally back home. No. Hey, laugh! Don't you wanna? Oh my God, dude! Stop yelling in my ear. Brown hood, brown hose. Uh, how much armor do we want to bring? Hmm. Not much, probably. I don't want that on me anymore. We weigh so much. Oh, it's because of this. Yeah, it's because of all this crap. I'll keep that because we're going to be in the woods. And sometimes you find random graves and stuff. So let's just get all this stuff put away. In fact, we could probably sell this real quick. Since he's up. Where did that go? What was that? A chalice? Yeah. Common communion chalice, rather. Where the hell did he go? Preshek. Dude. Wow, that was quick. Right back to the old grind, huh? I'm glad to see Yeah, likewise, friend. How did you get mixed up in thieving? I need to sell stolen goods. Bet on the tourney. Oh, that's cool. I didn't make a bet on it. Sell stolen goods. He has wow, he's got so much gold. Why do you have so much gold, man? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go by that. Oh, yeah. Wow. We are getting a horse soon, boys. I'm so excited for a horse. It's a game changer. It's gonna be amazing. It's gonna be a beautiful horse. Get rid of how many of these? 19? 10 more? Because I'm bad at math. <laughs> there we go. Uh, lucky playing dice. Yes, I'll keep. Take my cracklings. Take my spirits, my wine. I'll just keep the fruit and veg. I'm trying to eat healthy. Anything in here we don't need? Oh, I gotta put away my torches. Alright, we're good. Do we want to keep all those? Yeah, probably. Wow, this is nice. Uh, haggle. Oh, we bought a bunch of books from him. Or not books, like but um, the, the treasure map and then a book. Mm. So that's probably why he's got quite a bit of gold now. Agree? That's better. Okay, well, since we're friends... Finally. <laughs> there we go, buddy. Okay, cool. Now I'll go put our torches away. And I'll also put on my pants. The ever so sought after pants that we were looking for. 
This is better, yeah? Mm -hmm. So we can, we could have sold that. I'll just keep it for now. Might look cool on an outfit later. And I think we'll keep that. Put it on. Yeah, that seems about right. I mean, we can run around quickly in theory because we don't have like any plate or chain legs on. And then we're kind of guarded up top. Our vitals and stuff. I don't know if that's how that's going to work out at all. Uh, I don't know if we're going to be any quicker or anything, but it makes sense logically. So that's what I'm going with. Let's wash up. Now we got a date with Lord Coupon. God, we keep getting that thing too. There's a tourney happening in Rattay today. You can sign up with the Herald in the morning. Win the tourney if you can, which we can't. We'd get smoked. I did a little bit with the tourney um, on my old character. And by a little bit, I mean I did one fight. Got absolutely obliterated and then decided not to do it again. <laughs> How do I get up to that thing? Where's the path? What's that? What is that? Is that a bear? <laughs> oh. It's a horse. I thought that was a bear for a second. Like a dead bear. Wow, that's tragic. I mean... You do the math there. That boy took a tumble. Let me up. Yes. No! Let me up. I don't have much time. I've got an important meeting to attend. Let me up. Whoa. Did you see that? That was crazy. Oh my god, I keep doing this back thing. There's got to be a way to get up here. We're extremely fortunate that we haven't broken our legs yet. And I just remembered that I forgot to put away the torches. So, good on me there. Alright, I'm just going to go follow the path. Like I should have done in the first place. Now we should be able to get up here. Because there's a path that goes this way. So we'll be able to join up with that somewhere. We just have to... Oh, here's a path, in fact. This has got to be it. There we go. Oh, finally up that mountain. Oh my god. It took forever. What time is it? Okay. Still considered dawn. How's that, Bernard? Hey, what's up, Bernard? We're gonna go train with him soon. Oh, look here. Everybody's getting ready. Townsman, hired hand. Thetis of Townberg. That's somebody you can fight. Jeeber the Kipper. Can we actually watch? Oh my god, this is awesome. A mercenary by profession. Let us wish the combatants luck. Good luck, guys. Here, let's watch this. Hans can wait a sec. I see him in fact right over there. Come enjoy the show, Hans. I got red guy. Oh my god. He got it in the neck right away. I wonder if somebody will actually go down. Oh yeah, there you go. <laughs> he did a little squeal. Okay, that's enough wasting time. That's very cool that that's like an actual fight that you can just watch. It reminds me of Oblivion when you go up to uh, north of Bruma with the blades and those guys are like training combat. That would actually give you XP if you didn't know that. <laughs> you could sit there and just watch them and literally gain XP from it. Here I am. I'm overjoyed. Have you got a horse? No, sir. Where would someone like me get a horse? Good point. Unless it was a cart horse, I suppose. Well, you'll just have to trot along behind me like a good dog. Uh, can't I borrow a horse? But, sir, isn't there a horse I could borrow? Oh, certainly. Why don't you just have mine? Or, then again, you can just run alongside as befits a peasant. Take care now. I'll take yours and you can run, if you want. But that's not going to happen. This is his horse. God dang it. He's got his dogs here too. Why can't I take Bernard's horse? He's not using it. This is bull crap. Alright. Well, we'll hang out with the dogs, I guess. Got more personality than coupon anyway. These boys here. <laughs> I don't think this is a very long walk. I think we get to chat with coupon along the way a little bit. 
and then it skips forward, I think. Can we go? I think we could actually have a horse. Yeah, we could. I'm here. I'm right on your ass. How much closer do I have to be? See you, Bernard. Have a good day. Go watch the tourney, man. It's pretty interesting. Red guy's gonna win. Trust me. Pet on it. I should have pet on it. Look here, blacksmith. About that business at the alehouse. Yes, sir. Anush was right. I should have behaved differently. More, well, gentlemanly. But that doesn't mean you are in the right. You can't throw a lord out of the tavern in his own town. You understand? Yes. I, I was just... What? Speak up! Don't worry, I won't bite your head off. It's just that when you said those things in the arena, sir, I, I was um, a little upset. Ah, I'd just like to tease Greenhorns a little. And you vexed me too. You were insolent to Captain Bernard and they rewarded you with service. Whenever I do anything reckless, even if it's for my honor, Panosh is on my back about it and I get punished, like now. I didn't mean to threaten anyone. Well, it's all water under the bridge. Let's not spoil our hunt. I might go rent a bed at that uh, lodging over there instead of staying at Preshik's place. I feel like we're mooching off of him. Let us talk of something else. Is this your first time hunting? This kind, yes. What? Henry. I've been hunting since I could walk. If you're not a complete blockhead, you might learn something useful. And if you don't cock it up entirely today, maybe I'll take you again. It's always helpful to have a minion at hand. As I said, I have hunted before, but it wasn't... Chasing bunnies with a pitchfork isn't hunting. Observe and learn. I'll do the best I can, sir. You're going to regret saying that, Koopa. Because I'm probably a better hunter than you, dude. Not going to lie. If the other competitions are anything to go by, I'm going to whoop your ass. You know, he's only 15 years old, I found out. According to the wiki, Henry's about 20, an accident. Listen, I wanted to ask you about Scalic. Well, I don't know if... Um, that is, sir, I don't know if that's a suitable topic of conversation for the hunt. We're not hunting yet. I'd like to hear about it at last from someone who was actually there. The Cumans attacked Scalitz and, um... Oh, anyone who didn't flee. That's what they all say. I want detail. Is it really necessary, sir? Arguing with the nobility again, eh? It seems you're a bit of a rebel. No, not at all, sir. It's just that... Well, it's hard for me to talk about. I see. So I'll have to get you drunk first. Not sure even that would work. We'll have to find out, won't we? There's a nice little place just north of here. We'll camp there and you can tell me all about it. If you wish, sir. And don't dilly-dally. Can you stop for a sec? Oh no! No! I don't think he's gonna talk to us now. Check this out, the magic of editing. Sir? You're not gonna foil me twice. Missed. Oh wow, and it was a cutscene instantly. I literally replayed that whole introduction thing. Just so we could get that nest in that cutscene. I thought that there might be more that you had to say and I really didn't want to miss it. Worth it in my book. Objective failed. Win the tourney if you can. Quest failed. Rate tourney. Another nest. Or was it the same nest? Okay. You mind if I look around for a bit? I'm trying to find this nest. Could have been the one that we just ran across, to be honest. Like before the cutscene. What a shame that he literally had nothing else to say, and it was just jumping me up here. 
Bring coupon wine and break it. bacon. Bacon? For his saddlebag. Saddlebag is on his horse, probably. Yeah. You got bacon. Oh, I think they gave you a bow and arrow here. In this chest. And a couple of other bits. I'll take a peek in a sec. Here, let's grab a bite. There you go, friend. Coming up, sir. At long last. How much? Just one? Okay. That's it. Confirmed delivery. So, are you enjoying being on the hunt? I am, although we haven't actually hunted anything yet. That doesn't matter. Hunting is a diversion. The main thing is to get out of Rate for a while. Listening to Hanush's lectures all day long would drive anyone mad. What about your parents? Oh, we get to learn about him a bit. How come Hanush looks after you anyway? For a start, he doesn't look after me. I'm not an infant blacksmith's boy. Hanush is just managing my property until I'm an adult. When will that happen? What are you implying? Nothing. I didn't mean it like that. I meant that you seem quite adult to me already, so... Well, I mean, it's hard to say. Before he died, my father appointed a council of nobles to decide the matter. Only they can't be bothered travelling halfway across the country just to assess the claim of some stripling. Under normal circumstances, it wouldn't be necessary. The king would decide on my adulthood. Only... The king is gone. Just so. That's rough. So he's stuck under Hanish. Like I was saying earlier, before I got cut off by trying to get that nest, he's only 15 years old, apparently. And Henry's about 20 years old. Between 20 and 30, I think is what it said. So, yeah, he's not quite come of age. It's probably just because... He probably looks the way he does because um, there's no, like, children, NPCs or anything. So they would have had to make him a unique body and all that stuff. So they just gave him, like, a man body or whatever. Um, but, yeah, about 15. Probably, like, 15, 16 during the time that we know him. What do you do with your time? If I may ask, sir, what does a lord like you do all day? When I was little, I was awfully bored, I can tell you. There was always some courtier or teacher dogging my footstep. Now I spend most of my time trying to learn from Sir Hanush. Governing is no joke, at least most of the time. Only last week I had to listen to complaints from my subjects. But that could be interesting too, couldn't it? <laughs> my lord, this yokel here empties his piss pot in my yard. And sir, that old hag put a spell on my cow, and sir, my old woman is fucking half the village. Like a flock of sheep bleating all the time, even study is more interesting. What are we going to hunt? Humans. What? Humans? But... <laughs> you should see your face! <laughs> I got you there! <laughs> We'll see what we can get, but I'd like to bag a boar, one at least, and a few hares too, eh? But what about you? Before I couldn't get a word out of you, now your tongue's loosened. So, tell me about Scallets. I heard Sigismund had a hundred banners there. I don't know, sir. I didn't have time to count them. It's not easy for me to talk about, sir. My parents were killed right in front of my eyes. Well, couldn't you do anything about it? I mean to say, didn't Radzig put up a defence? They caught us unprepared. There was no time for anything. I wanted to save my parents, but it was too late. All right, then. I was only asking. I'm not a coward, if that's what you're getting at, sir. I never said you were. And I'd never let anyone call me one. Not even a noble. More honour to you. Well, never mind. Anyway, it's too late to go anywhere today. But tomorrow we set off at first light. Got it? Yes, sir. Alright, see, now we're understanding each other a little bit better hands. Quite like him now. Feel bad for... Beating him, beating him at all that stuff now knowing that he's only 15 or about that. 
We probably should have been winning. He's quite educated and stuff for a 15 year old. Built like a brick shit house as well, like six foot. Broad shoulders, five o'clock shadow. Jesus, they made him different in medieval times, I guess. All right, let's check out this chest. Uh, yeah, a couple of little bits here. Two and one, which isn't very good. That's also not very good. Hunting arrows, though. Don't mind if I do. And preserved food, which is always good. Take a bunch of that. All of the arrows, and we'll leave the other two things. Now, what were we supposed to do? Just talk to him again? Wait until dawn. Okay. Is there a, a nest on the map? Like right over here? No. There's not. So it was the nest from when we were coming in that popped up once we first arrived here. Where the dogs at? Where the hell are they? Oh, there they are. There's one at least. They're just like hiding in the brush. Anything else? God be with you, lad. What can I do for you? Sir? Not now, blacksmith. Keep it for morning. Right. Okay. Let's go ahead and find a place to sleep. Preferably underneath one of these so we're not drenched by morning. What a horrible day to be out in the woods. Right on cue, the thunder hits. <laughs> right as I said that. Alright, let's sleep and safe. Hopefully we don't get some ambulant. So, morning. Say, seven? Awesome. No somnambulant. What are you waiting for? Your lord requires you for the hunt. Oh, really? Such a renowned hunter needs help. You wouldn't dare mock your betters now, would you? Heaven forbid, your lordship. If that's the way you want it, peasant, we'll meet back here at noon. Whoever has the most head wins. Oh. And if you don't have anything to shoot with, there's a crate in the camp with some old hunting equipment. You can help yourself. After all, there's no sport in trouncing some wretch who hasn't a chance in hell. <laughs> By all means, Sir Hans. Ha! You'll soon be laughing on the other side of your grubby face. And now turn your back for a while. I know a few tried and tested spots in these woods, and I don't want you stealing them. Alright, go on. I think technically we probably could just follow him. Compete with Sir Hands at hunting. Same stuff in there. Okay, we're going to do this hunting competition in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you then.